Hey guys, what's up? So, today, um, I will put in description who requested this video, um, but someone did request it, I just cannot remember right now. Anyways, we're gonna hop into this video, and yeah. So, I have two bottles made already. This is, this is Olivia's, this is Bailey's. Hello, everyone who's coming in. Okay. Trying to get them to sit up. Um, okay, well, we gotta find a bottle for Grayson. You know he's special, so there's always a, there's gotta be a cool bottle for him to have. I think we're gonna go with this one. Okay, so, I have to make sure this nipple is open wide enough for him. Let me get this one. This one will work better. But I want to use this bottle. Silicones. And I actually need to talk to my mom about the one I'm getting. Hello. Ugh. Hello. Mm. Hey everyone, basically it's just coming in. Okay, so now we have these this bottle ready for Grayson. We're gonna put some milk in it. Yeah, milky. <laughs> Sorry guys, if you hear the babies, they are all playing on the mat right now. I'm surprised we don't have any arguments breaking out. Okay guys, so this is two ounces. Okay, so this is two ounces right here in this bottle. And then we'll put some formula in it. It'll need a few scoops. About two for each ounce. So about four maybe a little less no reborn do not move neither do silicones well actually a reborn and a silicone can both move it's a special order um that can be put in their belly so if you want one to move just order it that way That looks really good. It's the perfect amount. Oh, I definitely forgot this is not the right lid for this bottle and it's leaking while I shake it. I'm gonna go get the wipes. Alright, guys. Um, I also found Skyler's bottle, so this is Skyler's already made. And I think I have another, I have a, quite a few bottles in here. Because we just got back from our trip, if you've seen the vlogs, we were on the trip for a few days. No, we're going to not talk. That's one thing you can't make them do. Um, it's usually a special effect YouTubers add to their videos, like me. Did I miss any comments? Reborns are not rubber. <laughs> they're silicone. Or not reborns. Actually, there can be silicone reborns. There's actually reborns that can open their mouth like silicones can. It's really, really cool. But full body silicones, the main purpose of full body silicones are that they open their mouths and that they are softer and definitely more realistic. And you can put full body clothes on them. Silicone is not rubber. It's actually a very, very soft material that feels a lot like skin um, and muscle, like a real baby. So they're also, they're also, the purpose of them is to be more realistic. So just so you know that. And I can actually show you my reboot right now. Come here, Sky. Can you put down your toy, please? 
Um, I'm getting my silicone off of eBay, and so is she. Hey guys, everyone who's just coming in. Oh, hi, buddy. Well, you can see her, but she has a cloth body. That's the thing about reborns. All reborns have cloth bodies. It some reborns are some reborns cloth bodies are just smaller, like their full body arms. Okay. So she's gonna get your toy back. Thank you for being my little model. Hey, uh. <laughs> gonna sit her back down. I want your toy back. She was grabbing onto it really nice. She's playing really good with other kids. You guys good? Yay. Okay. Uh, yes, reborns can have a belly plate. Um, if a full body silicone has a belly plate, there's no point because that's just covering up the silicone they already have. So, you know, duh. Okay, so this is Olivia's Bailey's Bailey's. This is um Skylar's. This is Grayson's. Now I'm going to make Olivia's really quickly. She has a sippy cup, even though Olivia is the oldest. The age is Olivia. Olivia, Yana. Bailey and Grayson are the same age because they're twins. Um, Skyler and then my little preemie, um, Madison. Okay, now this bottle. It's really cute. Ah, I love this bottle. There's a little stiff in the nipple. I'm trying to get it out. So we're going to give her two ounces. Twelve. I definitely will do that. I'm really bored, so I'll probably do a lot of lives today. So, if you love my lives, it's your lucky day. And if you guys are new here, please subscribe. Because, like, I don't post every day, but I enjoy posting. So, I do it at least once a week and then every day on the weekends. My rule is I do it every day on the weekends and at least once a week. I don't... There's no definite that I'll do two or three, but I do do it sometimes when I don't have practice. And Friday does include the weekend, not part of the week. Okay. Why'd you spit your pasty out? And Rihanna, why'd you throw it? I saw it. She obviously does not want her pasty. Don't throw her pacifier, okay? It needs to stay sterile. I'm actually going to give them pacifiers. Grayson is a really big yeller when he doesn't have a pasty. You forgot you didn't have a passy. Mm. And then let's give Bailey hers. Let me give Yana one really fast. Um, at least two or three. Um, my Thanksgiving was really good. I enjoyed seeing um my my family that I don't get to see that often. Um, it was really fun. I love them so much. Um, just cause, you know, you just miss your family eventually. She loves their, her Dr. Phil pacifiers. I love these for her. Um, I'll show you that really fast. So, Jan is getting this one. You, little girl, can get this one. And then Bailey. Mm -hmm. Thank you. That's really sweet. Hi, sweetness. Oh, you okay? You okay now? Hey, you boy. Yep, you can go play. I don't know how I understand them. I just, I do somehow magically. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. So I need one more bottle. That's what I thought. I'm going to put my pacifiers back into my pacifier bag. Thank you. I really enjoy my kids. Okay. Right, I need her bottle. Hey, you. I need you too. 
Um, she does not eat a lot. No, I don't live in New York. Oh. I don't think I would really enjoy living in New York. It's too loud. It's really quiet where I live. I like that. Okay, so this is her bottle. She doesn't eat a lot, like I said. There you go. So we have these two. So Yana and Bailey. Yana, Bailey, Grayson, um, Skyler, and and this is this Madison's and Yana's. I'm trying to make it. So that you can see all the bottles, which is kind of hard to do. No, that one's way bigger. It doesn't show up behind that one. Okay, that's so weird. Okay, there we go. And you cannot even see this bottle. Here. Got an idea? How about we just do this? So these are all the bottles. Shifting them. There we go. So, like I was saying, ya Olivia's, Yana's, Bailey's, Madison's, Skyler's, and Grayson's. Now, the order I'm going to feed them in, I have absolutely no idea. Actually, I'm not ordering a reborn. I'm getting a silicone for Christmas. If my mom will get it for me, hopefully she does. But I will definitely do an unboxing of her. She's not supposed to come with a lot, though. Just, like, a bottle, pacifier, some clothes, a diaper. The basics. Shaking all the bottles. Really important. Okay. Now. Let's see. What do I want to do? I know. <laughs> okay. So. First things first. I'm gonna get Skylar a diaper change. Right. Yeah. Skylar is gonna get a diaper change. And she's going to get a diaper change after we fed her. Um, they don't need a diaper change. All the baby lives don't need a diaper change. Um, everyone's going to eat before they get their change. Then they're going to get changed. I'm going to put Madison into her night clothes because she's going to sleep for until she's time for her to go. She's going to sleep. I'm going to feed her and then she's going to go to bed. So, yeah. And then all the babies are just going to play while I feed every baby. And then they need to take an NAP. So, I'm trying to figure out, so do I. Um, I'm trying to figure out who's going to eat first and um, if who's going to eat in a diaper, who needs to be on the potty. It's a lot. Okay, let me think. Oh, this is so much harder than I thought it would be. I should have thought about this before we started. Okay. Um, they're all going to eat. Skylar's going to eat first. Then Madison, and we're just gonna go like this. So if you saw in the picture, it's like kind of like a circleish kind of thing. So Skylar is gonna go first, and then Madison, and then we got Miana right there, and then Bailey, and then they're playing on the mat. If you can see, they all have a little toy. Even Madison over there trying to hold her. So, Skyler, Madison, Yana all the way over there, Bailey, Grayson, and Olivia. It kind of, it's kind of cool how it looks like I'm holding their head. And I'm not, I'm just sitting right here and I fall away. Sorry if you can hear my sister's TV. Okay. Anyways. So, I'm going to put their bottles in the order I just said. So, Skyler, Madison... Yana. Yep, Yana. Then it's Bailey. Then Grayson. And I said it was Okay. Now I'm gonna get 
all the diapers I need. No, I don't. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to run downstairs and get some diapers. And I have a diaper pad right here um, for when I change them and for while they're eating that I'm gonna wipe up after everything. So I use wipes to wipe it down after I feed them and change them. So, if you guys don't mind, I'm gonna take you guys downstairs. Olivia, you're in charge, okay? Yes, ma'am. Great. She's not even watching TV, it's just on. But if I turn it off, she'll be mad. Watch. Everybody obviously remembers the kick set. Yeah. Good for you. I'm busy. 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 I don't know why I keep them downstairs. They're just there. These ones are kind of big. Bigger than I thought they were. Okay. Now. Okay. Great. Thanks. Looks like she's ready to take a nap. Huh. I don't know, she's hungry. Are you hungry, buddy? She's not here much. There we go. I hate propping them. But Skylar, I've propped Skylar for a really long time. And she's really never had a problem with it. I know it freaks some people out, but... When you have as many kids as I do, if you don't prop at least one of them, it's really a catastrophe. So, I feed her for a good five minutes. I don't know what you're talking about. They talk all the time. They've been talking the whole video. Um, I feed her five minutes just so she gets latched properly. Um, unlike some people who will just prop them from the beginning. But yeah, I prop her like after a good five minutes of feeding. And sometimes I like to start feeding another baby. So I think I'm gonna, I cannot feed Madison. Madison is very hard to feed because she's a preemie. So it's like near impossible to double tap with my two newborns. Sorry, there you go. I know this is technically propping, but I feel like I have more control. It'll be a year in April, so not long. Here we go. She's only a few months old, actually. But hey, and you're okay. Okay, so. I know. I'm gonna miss you, little guys. Like, Olivia is six years old, and I feel like it was just yesterday that I was getting her. Oh, it looks like I'm breaking her hand. I'm not. This actually helps her. Hey. Hey, what you doing? Getting all fussy. You can't hear it because she's so quiet, but she's actually really fussy. Hey, what's wrong? Uh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> A bottle fell out of her mouth. Okay. You want your bottle? I don't know if you're clogged or not. I just realized that you might be a little stopped up. Okay, give you that. And put you down like that. Hey, she's drinking. I didn't do anything. Besides put her head back, which you have to do for her to eat, drink. You gonna drink it? You were just drinking it. 
Okay, so I think it's time for me to prop her and get her fed. Now that she's got a taste of it, it's probably important that I keep feeding her. This is the wrong one. Sure there's no air in there. There we go. Now she's drinking. You, my little sweetness. Yep. Okay, spit it out. Let's see what's going on down here in your diaper. Ah, let's see. I don't even know. Did she even drink it? Oh, yeah, you did. That's why. Okay, good. Okay, come here. Let me go see. Let's go see. There's a little thing on my bed that helps her drink. Let's see if she'll do it now. her in this chair that Madison was in um so she can drink a little easier and also so she's not in the middle of the floor just reclined the the seat and now she's drinking it's this one or it's Skylar Skylar's a reborn and this one is a water baby <sighs> her belly button is so adorable Legs. Oh, she's too cute. I cannot with her. Okay. Nope, that one didn't button. Uh, I'm planning on doing one. I really have to clean up my room, which I don't feel like doing today since I just got back from a trip, but it will definitely happen. A, pe a lot of people have been commenting me to do one, so... She's drinking. Say, I'm drinking, Mom. Guys, this is a very slow process. I just want you to know. As you can see, I'm only pressing a little tiny bit, which you can barely see the flux in my arm, or my thumb. And she's not even out of the bottle all the way in her mouth. funny to see and hear her swallow. I remember when she was born and she was so tiny that they were feeding her through a tube and she used to have this thing where she forgot that she would, had been born and she would stop breathing and it was really scary but at the same time you know I'm glad that she's here with us and also it's just it's a memory. It's a struggle I'll never forget and just makes me appreciate her all the more than I do with a regular baby. Even though she's a premia, I still do love her the same that I love all my children, but she's just so cute and adorable. How can you not adore her? Even when she's waking you up like five times a night. Okay, there we go. Oh, I don't need to double knot it. It's probably a little too tight right now. Okay. Here's your bottle. Give it to you. Sorry guys, I know this is a really slow, boring process, but I'm trying to make it go a little faster, but you know, you can only make a feeding go so fast when you're the one, when you're not the one drinking. Here, Try, she never puts the bottle a lot in her mouth. Like it's always a tiny little bit in her mouth and it's so frustrating because it makes her spit up more. I had to move her head because 
since it's, it's like literally almost ending but that means that there's more a possibility for air to get in and that means that i'm gonna have a gassy baby on my hands which spits up more so we're really not trying to do that <laughs> you did it good job you never finished your bottle when you didn't Got a little milk on her face. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, let me clean up her little face. I think I need to give her a little bit of water just to rinse out down all that milk. She gets a little um congested sometimes. Ooh, way, way, way too much. Just a little bit. Don't need too much. So she might not need a diaper change, I'm really not sure. Probably, maybe not. But she gets a di diaper rash really easily, so I don't want to risk that. Okay, there you go. Thank you, I really enjoy it, like I said before. Mm. I did not burp her in between each feeding like I'm supposed to. Please don't spit up on me. I'm gonna put her bib up so she doesn't spit up on me. A little trick. If you're ever burping a baby, you can use their bib as a burp cloth when you don't have anyone around. Uh, oh, there we go. Actually, I have quite a few videos of how I'm making my milk if you look through them. I should make a, I'll make a playlist. I don't know if I have one, but I'll definitely make a playlist so you can find it um, after I make this video and then I'll announce it when it's done. Okay, he's spitting up, but I fed you really, really fast, so I'm not mad at you. There you go. I'm going to dampen this with a little water so I can wipe off her face. I know I have wipes, but wipes are not cheap, so... Um, yeah. Okay, there you go. There you go, you're all done. Thank you for cooperating with me, and I will change your diaper short... A short little while. Skylar spit out her bottle a while ago. So she's done. That was a good one out. It was at three and now it's at two. So she's all done. She drank almost all of this, but she's spitting up. So I'm pretty sure she's completely full. I fed her a lot today, so I'm not mad at that. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hi. I miss you. I miss you while I was on my trip. That's part of the reason I'm doing this video. Because I missed my babies while I was on my trip. I could only bring one. So she had to get babysat by her grandma. Isn't that right? So my grandma watched me. She fed me every day. Oh, here. I should probably burp her. I'm going to burp her and move Skyler at the same time. This is hard. Skylar, why are you hanging on to the chair like that? And you're sitting on the toy. Here you go. Hey, she is so cute. Love you. She's like, Mom, can I please go play? Oh yeah, and I'll show you the little toy she's playing with. The hard little toy she can chew on. Super cute. And no, I don't think there's any teeth in her future for a little bit. A little while. And she doesn't want her bassy, I just checked. So it's Yana's turn. Mm -hmm. It's nothing bad, you're not in trouble. Ay ay. Okay. And I did take off her underwear. She was wearing underwear, so she wasn't just naked under her skirt. You can keep that on for right now while I get your diaper on to you. These are humongous. I really thought they were smaller. Don't know why, because I know what she wears, which is creamy, and these are obviously not creamy. I'm definitely going to get some creamy diapers next chance I get. Okay, so... This is your bottle. You're getting some milk today. Bon appetit.
You know, I might be able to feed two babies at once. Actually, no, I can't. Anyways, guys, I want to start having a live conversation. I'm not... Because I'm bored, and this is kind of why I do live sometimes when I'm feeding them. I just get really bored, and it's cool to have people kind of with me, but not really. And she already drank all of it, so she's done. Let's wipe her. Gonna wipe all around that she's wearing underwear. Don't want any part left wet. So we're gonna get her all dressed up again. You wanna go back and play with your brothers and sisters? Or brother and sisters? <laughs> Yay! Thank you, Mama. You're welcome, sweetness. Oh, Skylar is six months. Um, Madison, she is a month, but really she's negative two months because she was three months early. <laughs> Luckily, she wasn't in the hospital too long. She actually just got back a week or so ago. Okay. And... This little girl here, she is two years old. She'll be going to preschool next year. So, are you excited for that? Yeah, boy. Can take that as yes. We're still walking on the clear communication, but she's actually a pretty good talker when she's in the mood to talk. Oh, you want your passy back? It's the bar. How come you ain't talking? Ah. Uh, okay. Anyways, guys, like I was saying, it's time for feeding. Oh, shit, shit. I think I'm going to change them on this, which is what I usually change them on. It's also a nap pad, so maybe I might not change it on that, uh, change them on that, but this is waterproof, the pink pad that they're on right now, so I like to feed them on that. I know there's definitely going to be water involved with that. Or not water, but liquid. You're spitting up. Special little girl. She's a spitter upper. I actually do have a pet. And okay, so um, if you saw the video, uh, my vlog yesterday, you saw those puppies. My dad said he's thinking about getting me one of those puppies, and they're like bulldog mixes. I don't know what they're mixed with, but it's a really cute bulldog, and they're so cute, and they get really big. And well, they're not big, but they're kind of medium size, which is the type kind of dog I wanted. So I'm super excited about that. But yeah, so I don't have, I do have a pet. His name is Max. He's a dog, and um. Yeah, but he just doesn't live with me. He lives with my dad. There you go. Do you have any pets? Anyone who's walking, even though there's, I think there's only one in here right now. Yeah. No, it's no problem at all. I'm, gl I'm just glad you're here. I love having new people to my channel. My channel has grown exponentially. In the past few weeks I was literally hit 100 last week and now I'm already at 230 it's crazy okay so this is Bailey Bailey is one years old and she's not a talker she's very quiet and stays a kind of away from the other babies except for her twin brother Whoa, that's so cool. Um, she stays away from all the other babies except for her brothers because, you know, they're twins, so she's just kind of connected to her brother in a different way, I guess. Hey, leave that toy on the mat, like I said. This is Grayson. This is Bailey's twin. He's one years old as well. He's the one of the two only boys. Um, Mason has not been on a video in it. God knows how long, so I'm definitely going to make a video with him tonight. Um, I have two water babies, actually. Um, 
Madison's twin, Mason was going not was expected not to be a twin, but Madison was born and of course because she was a preemie, I guess we just didn't see her or something. Um still kinda mad about that. I was not prepared at all. One of my friends actually had to take Madison, um, because I was just not prepared for that and so she took Madison, I took um um uh, Mason home. Mason was with me for a few days before Madison even actually came into the home for the first time. Um, because I just didn't have anything I needed for her. So one of my friends who actually had a, another baby girl and who was expecting kind of used some of the stuff that she was expecting for the new baby. Um, so yeah, but that was a thing. Madison was not expected, but I'm so glad she's here. I love little baby girls and little boys, Grayson. Yeah. <laughs> Sweetness. You need a diaper. Let's get this under you. Okay. You want your bottle? Hi! <laughs> Why are you so loud, buddy? Yay! I love how when a bottle goes in his mouth. I'll just show you. This one's not big, so it doesn't take long for it to come in. Yeah, he's a really fun baby, um, but if you plan on feeding him Play-Doh and um, baby food, it does not work because the Play-Doh, because there's moisture in his body, a little tiny bit of moisture will actually ruin the Play-Doh, and so you kind of just have to pick what diet you want him to have. I picked that I wanted him to have a regular baby diet instead of just a solid diet, um, just because it's a lot more fun to be able to feed him baby food and stuff like that. It just makes my schedule a little bit more flexible. And dang, whoa, buddy, I think I fed you too fast. You were like dripping all over the place, guys. Um, but like I said, so if you do get him, I'm just stating the warning. Um, yeah. He needs to be wiped up and he probably needs to sit out a little. I'm glad I had this mat down or all of this water would have been on my rug. Or not water, but pee pee. Would have been on my rug. You don't think it wiped all the way up. Like, you were so messy. You got a little in your hair. Don't ever get anything in your hair. You understand me? And my my He knows. He knows what he did. His hair is the cutest little thing to me. I hate when he gets anything in it. Subway. It's okay. Mommy's not mad at you. Well, I am. But I'm not mad enough to make you want to be on um, naughty later on because I yelled at you. <gasps> oh, you know better. You don't pee on mommy. No, no. I mean, I don't really care because like, you know, babies, they pee on me all the time. Thanks, that's really sweet. I love getting compliments like that. I love, I really like teaching people about baby lives before they get one or even if they learn something new about their baby they didn't know before. Yeah, you definitely need to sit out. He's like leaking on my hands. Okay, I have a towel back here he can just sit on. Usually when I feed him, he does have to sit out a little bit. But here's what I'm talking about. You see all that, that, that gross stuff? Yeah, I'm gonna wipe that up before I put another baby on here. Which is the cool part about having something waterproof. You can just wipe off anything gross. Hey everybody who's um, coming in, thank you guys so much for joining and watching. Please like as you're going coming in. Um, I know that's kind of annoying, like, ugh, but still. I like seeing that number go up, up, up. Now we have the last little baby that we need to feed tonight. Hmm. Yeah, I would totally get her. I'm pretty sure I know what you're talking about. Most reborns are good. Um, a little tip, if you're on eBay, do not get a reborn from China because usually those are mass-produced and they're not as realistic 
Um, but if that's what you can afford, go ahead and get it. I mean, any rude one that you have is going to be more realistic than any baby doll, baby doll you could ever have. Um, uh, I never really shopped on Amazon for a reborn because when I did, they were cheap, but I didn't really like any of them. I'm super excited for Christmas. I love the holidays, especially because my nephew's supposed to be born, hopefully. Not, well, I mean, he's supposed to be born like 10 days, 15 days after, but I doubt it. And honestly, I feel bad for my sister because if he comes right now, he won't be unhealthy. Um, he has a slight risk, but it's nothing major. So if he does come, it's not that big of a deal. And I'm excited to see him. I really do enjoy my babies. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Um, yeah, I mean, I would get it. To be honest, I would. Even if I didn't like it the most in the world, I'd probably get it. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. Okay. I just thought I then put a diaper back on Grayson, which I did. Didn't. Um, it's still over here. Oh, yeah. She's over here. Just know the ones on Amazons are probably going to be preemie or newborn. Just so you know. But I will grab Skyler since you guys obviously want to see my beautiful little bubble girl. And I have um, her twin, which isn't over here. Hi, birdie. She wants her passy. She can take a full pacifier. I cut her mouth myself. Um, I didn't record it. It was so scary. But, yeah. If you get a baby with a magnet inside. Yeah, I know, right? She can take a full passy. Ah! Are you happy or what? You bouncing. She's so cute. Anyways, guys, like I was saying, I didn't record it. It was so intense. But if you do have a reborn like her with a closed mouth and you really, really, really want to open her mouth and then you do it and then a pacifier doesn't even fit in there, um, if she had a magnet in her, it's probably the one thing stopping you from being able to put it in there. So just take that risk and push it all the way out. That's what I did. Um, it fell into her head and um, I tried it. I was like, what the heck? Who cares? Why don't I just try it? Because it had been like a month or two since I opened her mouth. Nothing fit in it. Um, so I just tried it and I was like, yeah, go me. We got it. Um, the only sad thing is that all my magnetic pacifiers no longer worked for her. Um, but I think it was really worth it. I do really enjoy her having an open mouth. If you can see me putting different pacifiers in her mouth. Um, yeah. So, yeah, guys. If you want to do that, go ahead. Sorry, guys, my back hurts. Wow, that's so cool. Okay. Sorry, trying to clean up my area a little bit. Have a lot of bottles scattered. You want your diaper back on? Of course. Well, pull up. She really should be. Wait. Oh my gosh. I just realized I switched these two little baby girls around. She's supposed to be wearing underwear. Because she's like six. She should not be wearing a diaper. Don't know why she's wearing one. I told you, Mom. You never listen to me. Yeah. Hey, don't get an attitude with me. You're going to get in trouble. Keep it up. I already apologized. You don't need to be rude. That's inappropriate. Do you want to go in the corner? Oh, I shall be. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay. Can I go play? Yep, go ahead. <laughs> Sorry, Mommy. I just thought it was cool to have panties on. Oh, it's fine because you didn't wet yourself. I'll go buy you some panties tonight, okay? Ah, yeah, go me. <laughs> she must really be excited. Okay, let's get this shirt back on you. She really fills it out now. <laughs> I'm such a puppy diaper. Oh my gosh. It's been 40 minutes. No, definitely not. 
busy making videos, hopefully, and watching The Flash, my new favorite show. I'm addicted. Probably be done with it by the end of the week at the latest. Okay, here you go. You go black and blue, okay? Okay. Whew. Feeding is over. Now the hard part, changing all of them. Oh, not all of them. I did a quick change between Yona and Olivia, so that's done. Now I need to change... Um... Uh, Skyler and Madison, and then I need to get him dressed once I'm positive he's done leaking, so. She's so cute today. I love this outfit on her. Um, I'm just gonna flip up her little skirt here and get her changed. And this is my favorite color, this pink color right here. That's my favorite color. Okay, so what I do is I unbuckle these two, and then I put the diaper under her, like so. And pull that out. And then she's changed after I give her a quick wipe. Done. Next, pull that up. Ooh, my sister's gonna be mad at me. Uh, you know you can call the police on that, right? Hi, if you're just coming in. It's weird it's oh there it goes it was saying it was one for a while after you commented and i was like wait that's no way two people just commented like really close to each other so there's no way there's only one in here anyways i'm just finishing changing skyler so i'm gonna go ahead and get these um onesies buttoned up and put her pants back on and then she can go off and play no streaky oh right it's not time for an nap so Definitely need to do that. Thank you for reminding me. Mom, I don't want to take one. Olivia, you are so close to getting a timeout right now. You have been so naughty today. You should not even be this naughty. I just got back from a trip. You should have missed me. I mean, you didn't have to, but still. <laughs> I'm, I am doing really good. How are you? And what are you doing? I'm just finishing changing Skyler, as you can see. And I'm right about to change my water baby. Yes. <clears throat> Whew, okay. Time to get our buttons undone. Let's see what we are dealing with, ladies and gentlemen. Yucky, yucky. Ooh, ooh, her butt has poop on it. That's so gross. <laughs> I'm so immature. For a mom, I'm so immature. Ooh, you need to wipe off the front and we can get to the back. That is rougher than it usually is. Mm, yep, definitely smells like poop. Okay, just making sure she's all dry. Uh, I don't think I'm going to put any powder on her. It's weird because Pampers smells so strong. It's kind of funny. Oh, it's really low, actually. I'm glad I did that. Did you hear that? It was like really loud. Oh, look how cute that is. It's so adorable. I don't know. It's big, but I folded it and now it looks super cute in like just her size. It's a little baggy right here, but I don't really care. It's just too cute. She's too cute for school, which is why she's not in it. Also because she's in my boat and I do not part with her. Uh, so I'm kind of a working mom-ish, but 
you know, just because she has to stay home. Um, everyone else goes, but she doesn't. But because she sleeps so much, it's easy. Skylar stays home sometimes, but most of them are in daycare or um, preschool. Okay, Grayson, it's your turn. Did you stop dripping? Yep, he's definitely dry. I'm gonna wipe him up. Because he definitely got dirty again. <gasps> oh my gosh. Got it in your hair, buddy. It's so hard to clean him up. Hey guys, everyone who's coming in, please like and subscribe. Uh, sorry, I know that's so annoying. I hate when people do that, but what else? <laughs> Let Bowie. Bailey's playing. You're, you can go play, okay? When I'm done with you. Bye. See, they always have to be with each other. That's how twins are, I guess. You sure you're done peeing? Oh, no, you're not. I always make this mistake, and sometimes he's not done peeing, and I let him go play, and he pees in his diaper. I really can't tell. If you're not done peeing, I'm going to be really mad at you, and you're going to get in timeout. I think I missed a comment. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay. Hands up. Guy! Can I go play? Okay, you need to get your clothes on and a diaper on, and then you can go play. How about that? Oh, yay! This is the 2016 baby life. Let me see. We're almost to the razor. Yeah, he's 2016. 2016, um, Snack and Luke. Mm, yeah, so I do. So do I. I love this baby. He's so cute. I wish he was anatomically correct, but it would have been hard to make a Play-Doh baby anatomically correct. So I think that's why he, they made him a Play-Doh baby, so that they could use that as an excuse not to make him anatomically correct. But what ifs? It's not that deep. Don't you pass there you go. I really hope you guys get everything you want for Christmas. I think so too. Okay. They're all playing. Now it's time for the NAP. Let's see about doing this. So, Skylar has a breathing thing where she can only sleep um, elevated. So she needs to sleep in a car seat. There you go. She's actually already falling asleep. I think she was about to tumble over. I want um, the silicone baby I'm getting. I want the silicone baby I'm getting. And I want some LOL Surprise dolls, the big sisters, not the little sisters. I have, like, two of those. Um, and I'm getting a phone, which is going to be super cool. And um, what else do I want? I want, um, that's pretty much it. That's really all I want, I guess. Wow. Oh, I, boy, I want the baby born. That's all I want. Hey, 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 hey. Why is everything shifted? This is so tight. Okay. Okay, let's move you over. I don't know what's going on, but you're, like, sitting wrong. There you go. And that was super tight on you. I'm sorry. Okay. Make sure all the padding is right. There we go. A more. Okay, now she's all in here. I don't really like the Lola Bell doll. It doesn't really do anything at all. And honestly, from all the videos I've seen, it just looks really annoying. Definitely not going to waste like $100 on that for Christmas. It's so dumb.
She didn't land as hard as it sounded, but this is just a happy birthday. Okay, now we've got little Miss Madison here. She needs to be changed into a sleeper because it's getting cold as the day goes on and she cannot get sick. It might be the last time she ever does anything in her life. Not to be so dark, but it is very important that she does not get sick and stays very warm at all times. The smallest bug could be the last one she ever gets. Okay, so. Time to get her into her sleeper. I have a rule that I never... There she is. My little naked baby. <laughs> she said, you having trouble holding up her head. Thank you. I really try to keep these girls nice and clean, especially little Grayson. Can you say thank you? Mm. Okay, I'm gonna take that as a I cannot talk yet. Yep, they sure do. And they just passed around to each other because they're so close. I think you're sitting on your sleeve, buddy. There you go. There we go. Done and done. Now, we button it up. Oh, she's so cute in this. It's humongous on her, but it's still so adorable. <laughs> Look. Um, they usually puke a lot and don't eat as much so it's a dead giveaway that they're sick <laughs> why would you be scared there's nothing to fear it's just for fun right that's what i think about there's a lot of people on my life sometimes and sometimes there are people i don't know and some people who don't care about what I'm talking about and want to be rude and disrespectful and say really, really disrespectful things. But if you do do a live and people are being rude and disrespectful, all you have to do is ignore it. Don't say anything back to them. That's always what I do. Um, um, doesn't matter. It's just them being dumb and mean and inconsiderate of other feelings. There is no one on earth who can make fun of you enough for you to stop doing something. Or there shouldn't be. Um, especially something that you love. Because it's not them stopping you. It's you stopping you. You tell yourself that they're saying stuff and that it's true, but... It's not true. It's only true until you make it true. Even if you're like 15 years old. I mean, look at Kelly Maple. She started the channel when she was like 9, right? But she's been doing it so long. And she has such a good fan base. She doesn't care. It's what she enjoys doing. And who knows? She'll probably be doing it her whole life. And there are going to be millions of people who say... Ugh, what are you doing? You're so creepy. You're so weird. I mean, my own family does it, but I don't care. I enjoy what I do, and so I do it. And if you enjoy doing something, do it. I mean, I know it sounds like, oh, you're just saying that. But no, a lot of people have been mean to me. Um, and yeah, so just, if you believe that you can do it and that you think you want to do it and that's going to make you happy and you're going to have fun doing it do it just do it don't think about what anyone else says don't say well they're being mean don't just stop caring just say you don't care what i think i don't care what you think let's just ignore each other well, your dad's a jerk, and you should probably tell your mom. And if your mom's not around or something sadly happened to her, then you need to tell an adult 
or, so, or someone else that you trust because your father should never make fun of you. It doesn't matter what you do. I mean, my dad doesn't make fun of me for this, but he does do dumb, mean stuff to me. So I completely understand what you're talking about. And I know, oh my gosh, I know you feel so, so powerless. But like, you just have to tell someone, even if it doesn't stop, the least you can do is have someone that's going to pat your back at the end of the day and say, hey, it's okay. I know he's doing this, but you can do it. You're stronger than what he's doing. And it's true. Everyone can un overcome anything as long as they really, really, really think they can. And I know that you can. So, especially if it's your dad, you need to tell somebody. But, yeah. Yeah. Look, Grayson fell asleep. I don't really like her anymore, but what she's doing is really brave. Thank you. Oh my gosh, Grayson knocked out. Look at the little buddy. Okay, okay he's going in the crib right now. Come on, buddy. I'm gonna load them all up into the crib. I don't want to take a nap. Oh, uh. mm -hmm. I really don't care right now. It's time for a nap. You're mean, mommy. Sorry that I have to be so mean, but it just happens. It has to happen. It has to happen. You guys be good. Good night. Okay, guys. One person has to sleep in the swing, and I think today I'm going to let little Miss Mom sleep in the swing. And she is taking her nap in her car seat, along with a few other babies. Oh, this is not attached the right way. Let me get it directly attached. Okay. Uh, night-night, Mama. I'll see you in a few hours for dinner, okay? Okay. I've never seen that show. Or whatever it is. Hey, hey. I love you, sweetness. I love you too, mommy. I sleepy. Okay, you go bed. Oh, yeah, I've seen her. She's really funny. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I really hope you enjoyed this. Sorry, I think I'm a little foggy. But hope you guys enjoyed this. This is a 63-minute vlog. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, it's really... That's a really cool place. That I've had a really long time. Um... I'm kind of tired, so I'm probably going to take a nap myself before I do the next live with Mason. Because he should be on his way home from his dad's house. Um, so, enjoy. Um, love you guys. Thanks for subscribing. And, um...